It's a Friday afternoon. I'm getting ready to go home, and uh, I never made it home. The last thing I remember is uh, the sound of crunching glass and waking up on my way to the hospital. Young man went straight through the red light and glanced the car next to me, T-boned me, and sent me across the street uh, into a ditch. I had uh, multiple lacerations, uh, chipped teeth, uh, had a uh, broken rib, all kinds of back and neck stuff, and uh, now the family's just like, uh, what are we gonna do here? Because they're used to not seeing the me in that condition at all. So now everybody's scrambling, trying to you know, pick up and take care of me. It was just a, a really uh, horrible, painful experience. Probably only four or five days after the accident. And uh, I received a phone call from the other insurance company. And they said they needed a statement uh, about the day of the accident. I, I felt really uncomfortable. I said, listen, I'm heavily medicated and I don't feel comfortable giving you a statement. And basically their response was, well, if you don't give us a statement, we can't, we're gonna deny your claim. So I was sitting there trying to talk to the wife and the wife was like, well, we need to, need to get, uh, get a lawyer. We met at the office. I was still pretty banged up then after we, you know, for what we met and I was like, no, this, this feels comfortable. So that's how we ended up with uh, the law firm. You know, I could tell that this was a disruption in the family. I want to give them as much information here so they can start sort of taking that, that deep breath so that we could get them calmed down a little bit. And he basically told me, he said, what I want you to do is get better. And that's what I focus my time and energy on, making my doctor's appointments, getting better, working for myself, trying to get myself back going. And, and to be honest with you, I trusted in him and I still trust in him and believe him today. Some people talk a big game about, uh, you know, treating people like family, but that's this, this is it. We're treating people like family. Like this is how I, I would treat, you know, my brother, my uncle, or my cousin, just like I would treat Terry. Will is a kind, compassionate, generous, and overall dedicated individual. Did exactly what he said he was gonna do. I still believe and trust in Will.